I'm Dr. Megan Marino. I'm an adolescent medicine physician at the University of Wisconsin, which is in Madison, Wisconsin in the USA. I'm very interested in how adolescents interact with the internet, and so I'm frequently asked about whether or not there is such a thing as internet addiction, and how can we think about keeping adolescents from getting internet addiction. What's tricky about internet addiction is that we have been interested in this as pediatricians and as researchers for quite some time, but we're still struggling with how to identify it and how to diagnose it and what that illness really might be. For now, I think what parents can think about is being a part of their child's life both offline and online. So I think some things that parents can consider are finding ways to interact with your child in asking them about their internet use, in asking them what they've seen. Is the information they've seen correct? Are there things that they've seen that have them worried? Are there things that they have questions about? As parents, you're still the experts in child safety. And so you still have the right advice and the right things to say, even if what's worrying your child is on the internet. I think that parents can also be excited to let your child be the expert in showing you new sites they've found on the internet, new ways to be on the internet, and then you have the role of providing guidance about safety, and your child gets to be the expert in technology in showing you all the whistles and bells and buttons on all of the websites. And that can be a great way to share information and be able to have your child feel good about coming to you to discuss what they've seen on the internet.